My name is Brady Beck. I'm a wildlife biologist for the Wildlife Resources Commission, and I've been working in the longleaf pine ecosystem for close to 27 years now. Right now, we are in the middle of the Sandhills game land, which is approximately 65,000 acres of public land managed for fishing, hunting, and other wildlife observation uh, purposes and it's some of the nicest longleaf pine left in the state of North Carolina. In the early 1900s, the longleaf pine ecosystem once stretched some 90 million acres across the southeast. Today, there is roughly 4% of that remaining. Longleaf pine is a super diverse ecosystem. It rivals uh, Amazon rainforest as far as plant community diversity as well as animal diversity. The red cockaded woodpecker is an endangered species. They live and defend territories in mature longleaf pine. Their cavity trees, we mark them with, with white paint, but they excavate their cavities in live pine trees, which is unique for a woodpecker species. And their habitat is maintained through the use of fire. The red cockaded woodpecker population on the Sand Hills game land contains over 200 groups of birds. Red cockaded woodpeckers are open pine canopy species. They thrive in areas where fire maintains an open, grassy, diverse ground cover, and that leads to a much more diverse insect community. Those insects then crawl up the trees and lead to better food resources for the red cockaded woodpeckers. Red cockaded woodpeckers will abandon a site if hardwood midstory encroaches on their cavity trees. Common forestry practices to manage a healthy longleaf pine ecosystem include uh, mechanical hardwood control, but most importantly, the frequent use of prescribed fire. We typically burn these longleaf pine stands every one to three years. Most of the burning we do is in the growing season, which would be from roughly April through July. That closely mimics the natural lightning season of a typical southeastern thunderstorm. During firing operations, the longleaf pine trees have a thick, thick bark that allows them to withstand rather high temperatures. The red cockaded woodpecker cavities, however, are very sappy and will burn readily. So we will rake the dry fuel away from the base of the trees so that we don't catch them on fire while we're burning. So, Aside from red cockaded woodpeckers, there are a number of rare species that rely on a healthy, frequently burned longleaf pine ecosystem. The longleaf pine ecosystem is a fire dependent ecosystem. Without fire, the diverse ground cover will succeed into a hardwood midstory, and that is habitat for an entirely different suite of wildlife than the diverse grassy ground cover that we have in a healthy forest. The longleaf pine ecosystem is home to over 900 species of plants, several hundred species of mammals, reptiles, amphibians that only occur within this ecosystem. Protection of the longleaf pine and the healthy ecosystem associated with it helps afford protection to all of those critters.